Hello and welcome back to the video darkroom. In this video, I'm going to give you the two minute version of how to import PowerPoint slides into Premiere. I do have a longer version of this that covers other methods of doing this. And you might want to use those if, for example, you want to capture the builds on the slides or it's important for you to get a full 4K resolution image into Premiere. But for this one, we're doing the basics and it will take well under two minutes to show you how to do that. That longer video is linked above just here and I'll also link it in the description. So let's start a two minute timer and begin. We're in PowerPoint and I have a presentation with about seven slides. Doesn't matter how many you have, but um, in this case, we'll just export them all. So we go to File and Save As and change the presentation type to PNG. You can also use JPEG if you wish. Um, they will be stored to this folder. It's in my project folder under assets and the name of it is going to be PowerPoint to Premiere slides. So I simply say save and it asks me whether I want to save just the slide that we're on or whether to save all slides. We're going to save all slides. Click OK and it's done. Go into Premiere and I'm going to just drag that folder into Premiere. Just the complete folder that has been created. Drop it into media. You can see now we have all of our slides and um, they're, they're in 720p format, but it depends if you're not doing them full screen, this may be good enough. So you can simply just take all of these and drag them onto your timeline. And I'll just press the backslash key just to set the timeline to the extent of the content that we have. You can now see all of your slides are there. If you want these slides to be presented in a smaller space, just go to effect controls and change the scale of them and position them wherever you want to, to put them over on top of whatever you have. So that's it. Job's done in under two minutes. If you find value in this video, then please give it a like. It really does help the channel and I would appreciate it. You can also subscribe if you want to see more videos of this kind. And I look forward to seeing you in the next one.